what is going on boys and girls of youtube we're on day three of my favorite gods uh, smite in smite whatever my favorite gods neutral maybe not in smite in general but we did wool yesterday i think we did mercury the day before so jungle adc and now we gotta cover mid mid if you watch my content you know what, what this is gonna be somebody last night thought i was gonna do kukulkin i don't know why or where that came from um but it's not <laughs> I, I honestly don't know. I only talk about one mage. That's it. Like all the time. And I have for years. So let's get into this. Plant some still up. Make sure you're liking the video. Make sure you're subscribed. If you're not, you suck. That's it. You're, you're a mean person. So uh, some still mid. One thing with still mid. Really still any role. I don't know why I described that. Though. You got to go poly. Polly is a 1000% must have item. It's game changing. It's an entire extra ability for someone like Scylla. Even for, we were talking about Kikulkin for someone like Kikulkin. Those gods, I won't say the require Polly, but if you're trying to hard carry, you're getting that Polynomicon. It procs late game for six to 700, somewhere in there. It hits very hard. And you're really not missing out on anything overall when you're purchasing it. Like you you might delay getting some CDR online. That's not the end of the world. You're pretty much replacing Soul Gem with Poly. And in, in a lot of mage builds, Soul Gem is very common. Well, you're swapping that out for Polynomicon and you're running with it because Poly slams. I like to go Book of Thoth and then either Poly and then Pen or Pen and then Poly. It really just comes down to how you think the game is going to play out and if you're going to get some early kills or not. If you get early kills, I kind of feel like having that poly online is going to be more power and more extra damage. If the game's kind of slow, getting Karn's coin online just to have the pen by the time they build defense will be really valuable for you. Get a red. Almost felt like I was playing jungle. I play Scylla so much in the jungle that it feels like she feels like a jungler, not like a mid laner to me. <laughs> I don't know why, but it's felt like that for a long, long, long time. So we're going to help him clear. Boom, insta clear and we're out. I still get questions about why the red to yellow star instead of yellow to red. Your jungle is free, able to path through, the, through their jungle and do whatever they want. And they aren't stuck in the mid lane. And that's valuable. I think I out this Vulcan just because it's Vulcan. Yeah. Somehow he hit two before me, which is... Like, like uh, he only he got XP somewhere that he shouldn't have gotten that the jungler didn't get because he was three creeps ahead, which is not the norm, not the norm at all. Oh, let's see that something. Nice. Let's kill this guy. What about see? Yeah. That's fine. Oh shit. Nice job, dude. That was a really good play for him to go to the wall and bait. Well, now we have full control. I'm not gonna let him get those, I don't think. Oh yeah, he's going for No, he's invading. I'm gonna hyper greed this. I'm leveling my two again, so I have mass clear. Usually you would have taken your dash second. You wouldn't even have had your root. But I was very confident I wasn't gonna die to a hun bats and a Vulcan. It's just not a a crazy kill comp. They can poke out a lot. Yeah, you can have that. Oh, I could have gotten it still with my two. Feels bad, man. Feels bad. He's not even trying to fight me. I thought he was gonna go on me. That's why I, I kind of played the way I did. Look at how much you're look at that clear. That clear is cracked there. He's finally able to start poking a little bit. He got first blooded though, so it is what it is. Be careful, right? All right, I'm gonna go to red here because it looks like my jungler wants to do red. Nice job. Every lane winning? I don't know about the Mercury solo. I wouldn't say that's winning. There, and now we're, uh, we're fairly safe with the dash up now. Don't ever do what I just did unless you're extremely confident in the way the next like minute to two minutes, really a minute is gonna go. You level really quick in the early game in Smite. So as long as you're really certain, yes. you're not going to have to run away and whatever else. Level the two is okay because it's going to up your clear time, but it is definitely going to result in you dying. Nice. 
Goodness. I don't know how a Ma eh, it is a Hoi. I don't know how Maui Hoi lane's lo losing, but it is Hoi lower clear. Into the. Okay, I We get it, man. We get it. You're a gamer. I'm gonna back now. Instead of wasting my time sitting here in lane, potentially dying to a hunt bad splink. For the win. Do that. Grab a warden. Be right back. Bye. And just head on out. We really don't miss anything off of this either. Farewell. He'll fast clear and then he'll probably back to do the same thing I just did and gain nothing out of it at all. I like this matchup, Scylla in Savulcan, because you both can fight and kind of do your thing but it once his turret is a factor i can root off the turret and just kind of destroy him is it you okay merc what's merc going merc's got manigan's golden blade and he's not died yet so props to him that's shocking to say the least like actually that's shocking yeah your turret isn't getting you any xp here but i don't really have much of a lead on the vulcan i don't think he i think he maybe missed one wave Oh, uh, I'd like to get these rights. Not getting the lefts early sucked. Oh, are they killing left? Kalina's damage is so high. Enemy missing middle. So the Vulcan went left. He might rotate all the way over there. I'm going to let him do that and just take the farm. He should be doing mids. Oh, no, he went over there. I really didn't think he'd go over there, but the Hun bats will be underneath. Makes a lot more sense. Yeah, you're out. Bruh. Your fate is determined. I think he's bruhing because he didn't want to fight again, and they did fight again. Words are so pretty. So Vulcan misses a full wave, does get an assist. Not the best trade for him, but decent. Could be worse. Time for us to back. He's holding the wave. So Vulcan did rotate. He must rotate rotated under. I don't know. No, there he is. Crazy he back. It's a lot of farm to miss. Just for a little rotation. At that point in the game, I wouldn't really want to miss my wave. If it's a full-blown fight, sure, but they rotated for the counter gank. And it wasn't necessary that Hunbats definitely got the kill without him. So I'm not missing a wave in that situation. They're definitely doing red. Oh. We're full clearing, so we're out. Go back. I know they don't have a ward here because they haven't been on this side of the map at all. Work. Oh, no help pot. On my way. Everybody's asking for help. I'm actually really confused. Art asked for help. Cleanus said on his way. But the Ares is the one who wanted to do the scorpion. This this game is whack. It runs all over the place. Oh, I wanted to get that XP. No. Forced that trying to kill those melee cubes real fast, but they did not die. Need to get my stacks online. Probably get the flat pen. That won't be good. Oh, Yi is actually a very easy gank as a mid laner, which sounds weird, but as a mid laner, you're. Oh, shit. All right. If my Ares is a little more patient, waits for my route to land, he definitely can uh, chains off of it all day. Poking, dodging the poke, nice. Really good play from this dude. Like, actually, I'm easy. Oh. oh. My two just went down and then didn't go down again. Oh, no. <laughs> I rooted his back. He had beads anyway. So it doesn't matter. Okay. Oh, my dash is back up, so it should be good. I don't know what's going on here, boys. Doing damage to make sure my team feels safe. This guy wasted his ults. Kind of poorly, actually. Got another kill out of it. And my art kills the, the one v one This game is crazy. Oh, no. I actually live here. And didn't even miss the farm. Good plays. 
I'm in a great spot now. So with this lead, I'm not going to go pen like we talked about. You go pen if you needed it. I'm going to go right into the poly. With the polynomicon online, it'll give us a little bit more sustain. That sustain is very minor. You do not notice the sustain throughout a match, but it, you know, it's there. It helps. Then we'll go pen. If the enemy team doesn't surrender, it's really looking like these dudes are about to surrender, to be honest. That change was great from the Aries. It was just so easy to combo off of. Oh. Good knockout. Great, great play for the Aries, man. We're just kind of running at this guy. I feel bad. I feel really bad for this guy, actually. <laughs> this Vulcan just can't play the game, dude. Oh, I think we dropped my red and I wasn't able to pick it up, which sucks, but it is what it is. 3-0. Oh. I'll take the loss of the red buff here. My team's all going right. I kind of want to rotate over there to help. Yeah, I wasn't going to unless I'm bad swine. Oh, no. They traded and left. The interesting uh, fight because Hanbats is going to show up with his ult and I don't have my beads so I need him to ult him, and still down. impact the fight there it is I tried man oh he's too fast oh he's going back in Holy crap, this is a crazy game. There's so much fighting on my poly online. Now, if I had my poly there going into that fight, oh, they definitely don't live. I shouldn't have missed that too, but he got that speed buff they get off of the Maui throw is nuts. Like, that's a lot of movement when you're trying to catch somebody, especially with, since I don't have a speed buff. I'm used to running around as a jungler. All right, there Ho Yi's going crit, Hunbats. Hunbats is having a decent game considering. I was able to shut him down though, which is good. Get his uh, streak out of the way. <laughs> What's going on? Boy, just running around, buddy. I missed another red buff. I'll use the wall to block us there. I think his leap is still up. Ult him, ult him, ult him, ult him, this. Oh my gosh, he level one health. I feel like that didn't do any damage right there. That was crazy. I didn't need a beads though, stupid. Okay. I don't know what's going on now, but okay. My support for their mid, and we got a lot of pressure off while my solo and jungle are running around freely. I will gladly take it. Kind of wish we had gone for their Scorpion, though. Well, that's unfortunate. I was trying to wait to pop my two. Feels bad. <laughs> he said, you know, I had to commit yes. Need healing. all day, dude. I'm, I'm with you. If you want to dive determined. a tower, I'm going to follow up 100%. It's for some kills. I'm behind you. I just don't want to be the one tanking the tower. That's where I start to have issues with the situation. I don't want to be the tank tank tanker. I want to be the tanky. Does that makes sense. I don't think of that. What in the world? Where does that come from? What can going for scorpion? Your left tower is under attack. Hmm. I didn't get there in time. So close. It's really unfortunate. That would have been a nice little bit of gold to steal, especially since I dropped the uh, the pyro farm for free. They're still in this game all of it, though, so it might be a good thing I didn't, didn't secure it. One for red. Hmm. I feel like they don't have a warder. Oh, he's going to know, though. Is 
not picking it up. I'm just gonna back out. I don't want to keep being too aggressive. I'm sitting on a lot of gold right now. I really don't want to be here. I want to help him get out. Literally just here to help him get out. Oh, I ulted. Oh, we did some damage. Oh, they're taking a lot of damage, actually. They took a lot, a lot of damage here. We're in a good spot. Dang, how are you gonna miss that? Nice little poke. My poly's only hitting for 130 right now because we have no power. Oh, I threw it short. That's unfortunate. Nice kill. They get a gank off over there while we're messing with them in mid, so it could be worse. All right. Nice shooks. This Vulcan is uh, really, really annoying. I'm not gonna lie. Hunbats definitely still has his ult up. That's why he's playing underneath. That's a good gold fury call. I think they're gonna go towards the left and do blue, or I don't think they'll force fire. They don't have a good team comp for fire. If they had a better team comp, they could definitely do some crazy stuff like pull fire. He just insta killed my red. I miss, so <laughs> I miss that XP every time, dude. So I'm killing so fast. Now we're going into pen. We have a full Karns coin. I'm going to grab a ward just to be uh, a real gamer. And I'm going blink here to be hyper aggro. I talked about this yesterday's video. In yesterday's video, I was playing Ool. Aegis is the go-to. Aegis is the standard. Aegis is the better active. But when you play past just getting better and you're trying to have you know a little bit more fun or you're playing with the boys and trying to make plays or for me like as a content creator i'm almost always just playing for the plays on stream i'm not just playing to win so i feel really comfortable when i'm able to get blink and play around the blink it's it's fun for me so that's what i'm gonna do here highly would recommend going i guess the way this guy walks up right spotted Dang, he just got out of range on that too. Ooh, that sucks. He full clears. I'm gonna do anything. Easy clear. I think we should play for Pyro left side. Oh, <laughs> man. That's beads. That's a good play. Go, yeah, we're on full disengage. They can't kill my Ares. So as long as I don't let them get to me, we're chilling. This on bats is low, low. He's a low, 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 low. Oh, he TP it out. That was a good TP out. that damage off real easily actually someone's on the left i think it's no it's on bass nice that was clean oh i hit him oh he's so low am i gonna kill him in time Unfortunate. Let's get out of here. Guan's coming. I might actually die. I don't know where the Guan was this whole time, but he was he was at that fight. We die. Yes. Yeah, I'm out of here. They can do pyro for free. Nobody's over there. They chased me to red. This hun bats doesn't stop going in. It's wild that he went back in there with like 10% HP to me. We can set up for gold, get vision for fire, and kind of just win the game here. We go into Soul Reaver, Mass Burst, Max, really everything. We could go for more CDR at this point. Not a bad thing to do. I don't really like Soul Gem though with Poly. That's my issue. So Spear of Dessa would be something you'd be looking at grabbing, I guess. I'm kind of just going to get away with it. We'll have 30% pen late game. 
Your, or sorry, cooldown, not pen. Pen, we will have uh, either 20% or we could go another pen item. Which could be kind of spicy to go ob shard and just clap the Maui instantly. He'll have no defense. Oh, that was so good. Oh my gosh. On my way. Completed. Retreat. He hits anything. I'm down there. Oh, okay. oh, I miss easier. Oh no, it sucks. Get a polyproc though. All right. They really do want to kill me. It's kind of crazy. Gonna get my polyproc onto the Vulcan. <laughs> Got a blink combo still. Oh, okay. Fire's a good call. Not like one ult's down. It's a free call, pretty much. The grouping of our team is really, really good. Our team comp is not really good. That's what's uh, kind of cool to see here. We have a very single target esque team comp between, honestly, everybody Mercury, Kleena, Artemis. Even me and Ares is very single target focused. I don't have cooldown in this build other than 10% off starter, so I will not have secure here. Yeah, I think we just kill this guy. There we go. I'm gonna back. No starter yet. He can chase that kill if he wants. He should be pretty safe with the walls. Gonna disengage, grab a counter ward, and go get my red there. Yeah, there it is. What's he got? He's 9-0 and, oh and I'm 6-0. And, oh. and Artemis is 6-1. Oh, well, I'm the only one who's not died yet in this game. Let's keep it that way. The way it's meant to be, right? The way it's meant to be. I love Scylla's 1, by the way. Like, like Scylla's kit is kind of filth. If you really think about it, at its core, you have a root that at max rank roots 3 people. So you can AoE root. So you can hit a creep. You can hit a Vulcan turret. You get anything, and it'll combo root, right? Your team. That's a very strong. Oh, you messed up here, bud. Ooh, or did you? Or did I mess up? I don't know what that was. I honestly have no idea what he was doing right there. I'm playing low cooldown build. So if I didn't have really Book of Thoth and I went cooldown, that dude has no chance of winning that matchup. The only reason it seems like he has a chance is because I have long cooldowns. He really had no chance. I'm full health. I don't I don't know what the strat was there. There was just no way he was gonna kill me. Now I could die to a hun bats combo. I don't have beads up. Do they know I don't have beads up? No. Do they care? I have no idea. So I don't really want to stick around and find out. He's gonna keep pushing. Gold's a good call. Getting tier two here would be nice. There's so much gold on the map for us. We have three towers. We have gold fury. Really, there's a lot of neutral farm that's about to be up too between their side of the map and ours. Level 20. So we get my starter now. I don't know where they are, and my team doesn't want to push. So. Just gonna come on over here and secure. Uh, boyos, I'm gonna back. I want my extra cooldown. Yeah, right lane's the move, but now we have so much gold that we're backing. I'm gonna double up here. So I'm doing something I don't usually do. And there, there is a reason behind this. This isn't random. So I just bought my red pot, right? Even though I have a whole item slot that I haven't purchased. I'm only, you know, five items deep. I do this when I have, it's a last, last ditch push or a last ditch defense. Meaning the game will end if we win a fight or lose a fight. So if we're defending, if we lose this fight, you know, the game's over. If we're pushing and we get a good fight, the, game, we, the game's over. That's why I do this. And you'll see players do that a lot. Like the SPL, you'll just grab a 500 pot on your way out because you know a major fight's coming. It's not super common, but it does happen. We should just be pushing right, so I'm gonna come on over here. Oh my, they're so deep. Let's push right. Uh, we do have a fat wave, I guess. We have a fat wave in both lanes, though. That's a really unfortunate death. This is a really bad poke to be getting hit by. Oops, a little late there. 
I, I, was, I hesitated too much. I have my blink. So I'm gonna look to blink in here. Oh shit! No! That was a good. They, that was a great defense from them. Oh, that was a great defense from them. That's all I gotta say. The fact that Humbats picked the guy and left though without ulting is kind of why that went poorly. And our Mercury won't group and end the game. I don't know why. He just keeps going left. It's all good. It's a we still win this for sure. Like that was a hard throw though. We should have at least got one Phoenix. I could have killed that Humbats. I hesitated and I shouldn't have. I should have just gone hyper aggressive. Unfortunate. Good play from the bats too. When he leaped, he leaped massive amounts of damage from me. That would have definitely killed him. What is this? What is this build? Golden Blade, Frostbound, Toxic Blade, Zerg Shield, Shogun. How much attack does that have? Cap attack speed. Behind us. Okay, you just gave this guy a pyro. Yeah, I can't out secure him. He should actually okay, but Queen is here. Oh my gosh. That's actually embarrassing because this Mercury is trolling. This Mercury is hard trolling. He watched. He could have fought. He could have just dashed the Hun Bats on the Pyro and gotten it for free. We need wards. We need you to not die. It looks like my clean is okay. So I'm going to go grab red. Never mind. Someone took the red and it wasn't that. That's actually kind of really good for them that they took the red. I'm guessing it was Vulcan. Oh, I'm here. We'll kill somebody. Let's go. Any auto attackers? There we go. That dude just got destroyed. Bro. Get my distance here. Attack! Attack middle lane. Oh, I just slammed him. He was not expecting me to hit that ult over the wall. No shot. Good play from the Mercury to pick him up. All right, where's Hunbaz? Let's see this bats in a second. There he is. He's backing. His ult's up for sure. Okay. Oh. Oh, that was so good. The Merc ult to force the beads into the perfectly timed Aries ult. Good play, guys. Great play. I ended up dying when I said my, no deaths, but they had a really good defense at that last uh, at that last Phoenix. And then they threw it all away because this Ho Yi is just W King getting picked. Ho Yi fought perfectly under the last Phoenix too, so I don't know why he just did that. He chased so hard, just right past us. It's like he didn't even see us. He might not have. Should have though. For sure should have. This damage. I love Scylla, dude. I love it. It's just so satisfying hitting a root, an auto, and a two all in the same rotation it's like nox combo if nox combo was good and easy to hit that that's what it's like it's kind of wild to be honest so that's the match if you like the video make sure you're liking the videos if you aren't subscribed already hit the subscribe button and i will see you in the video later tomorrow the next the next day also uh, happy new year to everybody because it is you know it's new year's video i'm recording a, on new year's eve essentially during the day uh, but yeah, happy New Year's. I'll see you all in the video tomorrow and in the next year, I guess.